Uh, excuse me. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> cough, cough, F12. Woo, Garcia. Maybe we'll F12 and see if anything would have gone different. Or Avery, Avery's in chat. Let me know if, if something different would happen if we were to reset. I don't think it would have, but I don't know. I see you've lost track of it. I think it's just like a, a, a rating on the case. Yes, I saw it go that way right now. It's up to you. Up to you. God damn it. Surely you saw a Togetic run past you. I am ashamed to admit that I was bested by my own ditto. Before my very eyes, I saw it turn into a... A Lugia! Grainy and sharp-eyed. Like the photo he and I saw it in a year ago. I barely escaped Aida. I can't call this thing I eat it this whole time. I'm sorry. I doubt it'll I doubt it'll try the same in here. It collapsed the entire building. Wait. So it turned into an Empoleon Alugia and then turned into a Jolte. How fast is this thing exactly? Extremely. Adidas? Yeah, he's got them, them fucking Jordans on. No, because Jordans are definitely used to run fast. 100%. Hey, hey, did anyone tell Clementine you were back safe? I'm getting my coat. What? A D don't? Clementine's Arcanines are going nuts, too. So, uh... So, where's Clementine's room? Not there. It's not in our room. Mid-left. You, you're not very slick. Clementine's Arcanine would never destroy their own equipment. Dr. Aristarkov, yes, you, get in here and guard the door. I, I, Aida? Ah. Oh, hell nah. Ah, I concede. That's slick. Now, how am I supposed to tell which one is not the dogs, which one is the fake? Surely there's something different about a ditto's biology compared to a regular one. At the very least, I can visit my office knowing Aristarkov's not going to let the dogs out. He would probably win against an Arcanine. Alright. I really like this case so far. I'm going to be honest. I really do. I think it's pretty cool. Alright. Let's... You've got Arcanines in here. Alien. The case. The so one that's black with orange stripes. <laughs> All right. Um. So I guess we could check the Pokedex. Yeah. Okay. So if we where's page up? There it is. Your it's Pokedex button. That... What? What? Well, is that like your menu button? What do you mean? Page up? Page up, page down is how to go through like stuff quickly in RMXP. Oh, of course. Okay, so we have Ditto and we have Arcanine. I think Arcanine is right here. Okay. 
This fleet-footed Pokemon is said to run over 6,200 miles in a single day and night. The fire that blazes wildly within its body is its source of power. Okay. So, the fire that blazes wildly within its body is its source of power. So, its source of power is, like, fire inside its body. Is this actually true, or is this, like, a metaphor for some shit? And what's Ditto? Let's look at Ditto, just because we can. Truth? Hmm. A Ditto rearranges its cell structure to transform itself. However, it tries... If it tries to change based on its memory, it will get details wrong. Here's the thing. Uh, I don't... Pokedex is never wrong. Okay. Um, the thing with me is that I think the Ditto transformed into an Arcanine based on memory. So... Excuse me. Can I, like... I don't think I need this right now. Cap, though. You always need it. See black with orange stripes. So what detail could be wrong? Yeah, I don't know. We haven't really checked out any of the Arcanines yet, right? Um, it's not sick leave. What is the untrainables? Is it just Pokemon lore? More Pokemon lore? No, it's not that one. If it speaks perfect English, it might not be a regular Arcana. <laughs> just like Meowth? What's the Poke Preservation again? Kanto Safari Zone. Is there Ditto in Kanto Safari Zone? Or is this just... It's just lore. Elemental Fundamentals. If it has a New York accent, it may not be a regular Arcanine. Oh, we already saw this. Okay. And what's this? Tops and tails and bells and whistles. This is what might be in here. Um, Eevee, Skitty, Absol. Well, I just want to read this. For this reason, ornamental parts of Pokemon body are also used to indicate dominance in Pokemon that form hierarchies. The Alpha must be the Pokemon with the highest level of physical fitness and highest chance of survival in order to protect the ones below. The most famous example of this world would be the Empoleon's metal horns, the height of which determines its place in the pecking order. Damage to the horns is seen as proof of poor fitness and as such can get Empoleon knocked down a few places in the social hierarchy until, until they are protected and not the protector. Uh, Tech made a whole script just so we can lore dump the players. I mean, hey, why not? Okay, uh, I don't think we can really use anything else in here. Oh my god, that bug. Alright, I guess we could... Shall we examine the Arcanines right now? Oh, also, I just... God dang it. I just... Not... This is good. Bro. Is it... Use a medical instrument. Oh! Interesting. Okay. You know what I think we can do now? I think we can go and grab, like, the thermometer, right? Theoretically, we should be able to grab the thermometer. And then take its temperature, possibly? Or what's this? What is the ultrasound scanner? We don't have... We've never used this yet. We haven't used this. I think this might be, uh, this might be useful. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That too. 
can give a detailed look at a Pokemon's internal body structure. I think that will be useful. Ultrasound scanner to see if your Pokemon has... Okay, so we have the flareometer and the... Ultrasound. For right now, let's try that. I'm sure we can always go back and grab more things. Good God, this... Um, but hopefully these are the only two items we're going to need. Hernia, I barely know. Uh... Alright. Where is it? Let's... Yeah, let's use a medical instrument. Let's use the flareometer. Flare output very high. What else can we use on this thing? Um, what about the ultrasound scanner? Oh, what? Hold the phone! Huh? Bro, what? Dude, I literally am going to have to tilt my monitor to see this thing. Can we reset? Can we reset this shit, please? Okay. So if you use the ultrasound scanner on this thing, this thing looks like it has, like, bones and shit, right? And then we also... And we also have the very high flare output. Okay. So, let's look for the next one, which is currently in a corner, um, which is, let's, let's do the ultrasound scanner, and this one also has the skeleton um, of a normal Arcanine, and let's use the flare, flareometer. Okay, now we're currently trapped. All right. So, those two match up, right? So, theoretically, theoretically speaking, theoretically speaking, um, all, all of them should be kind of similar to the, to that thing. So, we use the ultrasound scanner on this thing. This one also has a skeleton. And then this one... Let's also use the flareometer. Very high. You found the ditto once before, but lost him when you switched mods. That's what I was. That's what I was um, assuming. Okay. Can I please track you? Okay. Let's use the ultrasound scanner. Okay. Yeah. This one doesn't really have a bone structure. Um. So if you use uh, the flareometer, extreme. It's no, no longer very high. This is the ditto. All the signs point to it being you. Okay. Your vital signs are off. Your anatomy is wrong. Your anatomy is wrong. Hey, yo. What the fuck? Ow, 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 ow. Watch the bag. Aristarkov, get the door! Uh, okay. Once again, best case. True. Okay, yes, I'm going to save. Anon did well, yes. Or Anon, I have no idea. Aristarkov! Why the heck did he leave? I would have remembered telling him to... Footprints. Human footprints. From the kennel to the door. Aristarkov can't have made these. Or me. I don't believe it. The ditto might have t turned human. After 20 years of being here, I have the authority to at least call one emergency meeting. Yo! Yo! Hit the... Hit the... Hit the red button! Emergency meeting! Yo, who's sus? 
sauce? Man, I miss that. I miss that game. There is an imposter among. <laughs> I miss that game so much. Everyone to the lounge. Red sus. <laughs> Red sus. Ranko? Is Ranko sus? Ranko, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Among, <laughs> Among Us. <laughs> Isn't that a Pokemon? Amoongus. Pink sus. Amoongus. I know you're all wondering why I needed to get you all in one place, apart from Clementine. The Dittos destroyed the only way of contacting him. But... Seeing as it's been my responsibility to chase around the rogue Ditto, I believe it's also my responsibility to find it one last time. Hey, just tell them the Ditto's a human now. It can't do that. I saw it with my own eyes. Gentlemen. Yep. Okay, we just... Anyway. Thank you. First of all, by the way, rogue is the color... Am I pronouncing it wrong? Is pronounced rouge. Rouge? What? Oh wait, is rogue? No, rogue. It... Rogue is G U E, not U G E. Man, if you rearrange the first letters. Um, of the... if you rearrange the first letters of the first names of the scientists, it spells among us. Look, it's basic French. No, I'm kidding. Rogue is the kind of persona. Rouge is the color. <laughs> First of all, we're going to narrow down who is the Ditto. <laughs> the culprit destroyed my equipment, so I'll have to rely on eyewitnesses. Be thankful I don't need to g give any Star of you. Star Wars Rouge 1. <laughs> Be thankful I don't need to give any of you an ultrasound scan. We need to be completely certain maybe the Ditto li likes lipstick. Because then we force them back into their Pokeball. Naturally, I should have mine on my belt. But don't they only do that if they faint? I think that's what she's referring to, Marley. Now I know. I am a Nurse Joy, but as a last resort... I'll make my chance to use last resort on the imposter. POV, you killed Ditto. <laughs> now, if you don't mind, I'm going to get her from my office. Uh, no, I don't trust any of you, but okay. This is literally the meme. I'm a healer, but... I'm a healer, but loads ra last resort into Chansey. Sup, buddy? Hello there, Chansey. Are you prepared to do some battling today? This is going to be hard to explain afterwards. We're just... One moment. Nice. Alright. Ah, yes! The Getsus theme! The Team Plasma theme! Such a good theme. Amazing. I'm back. I'll tell you who I think the Ditto is. For the last time, would the Ditto please come forward? Oh, well, it was worth a try. But a ba dum <laughs> If everyone tells the truth and gives me as much information as possible, no one's gonna get hurt. Incidentally, I also promise not to tell anyone on the mainland about this. Huh? What? Will the real Slim Ditto please stand up? Dr. Will. Bro, we have to remember this shit? Oh, hell no. Nah. I don't remember. Okay, so I'll need you to be more specific. I'm aware. Okay, so Doctor uh, Will, Doctor Will, I believe was with us when 
I will tell you one thing, Lux guessed this one without talking to anyone and got it right. Spoilers, the real imposters were the friends we've made along the way. Whoa, it's kind of dark, Avery. Scam. It was all about the friends we made along the way. <laughs> I like to imagine Ditto isn't in the room. I would like to imagine that as well. Good lord. So, Could someone remind me what that's from? Because I've heard that so many times. Okay. I wasn't thinking about it too hard. It's just hanging outside having... <laughs> Bruh. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Okay. So... Will was with us when it's just vibing. Will was with us when we were questioning the Delcaddy, the Zwilus, and the Pikachu. So Where were you just after Ditto entered? Guarding the long lounge with you, you remember. Okay, so what do we what do we or let's not do that. Um, what about her memory? Tell me a secret. Something only you would know. Hmm. This beanbag I'm sitting on is a bit understuffed. Okay. What of it? Dr. Taijiri. Where? Taijiri. Did we ever see Taijiri? I don't think so. What about his memory? Yes. Why was Pikachu sick? The flu. Definitely the flu. Okay. Go lightly. I don't remember the, much about Go lightly. I know that. I know that Go lightly was not. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Golightly Skitty that... Okay, tell me about ice cores. In layma, layman's turns, it's a long sample of ice drilled out from... Wait. You're... Are you referring to my Delcaddy, Aida? Yes, I do remember. Okay. Dr. Aristokov. Where were you... Before the meeting. I once I saw the human shape run out of Clementine's dorm. I followed him followed him into the greenhouse. But all I saw was my rose raid. Did you happen to see anyone on the way there? Hmm. I saw Dr. Taijiri hanging by the entrance. Thanks, Doc. Um where were you before the meeting? At that point, I decided I needed to get back to the entrance and try unblocking it. What? By then, I was hoping Dr. Clementine would come back and unblock it from the outside. From there, I saw Garcia head into the locker room for some reason and Aristarkov into the greenhouse. Okay. Dr. Scarlet. You woke me up yesterday because my Zwilus was hypothermic. Correct. And of course, Dr. Garcia. You have, you should have a list. The Ditto could not have been at least. Well, I think the only person, the only people, Taijiri and Aristarkov, are the most sus right now. Um, I don't know about Garcia. About your location. Um, okay, that was that's another bug. What's your diddle like? An ineffable creature who surprises me every day. But of course, once this is done, I'll give them a stern talking to. I mean, you know where Aristarkov was when the Ar Arcanine escaped. Yeah. They've taken a liking to Dr. McCloud, perhaps because she's also a shape she also has a shapeshifter on her team. You can see how they would be compatible. 
Bidettos can breed with anything. Don't be so vulgar. My ditto has taste! Pra. We can continue to explore around here, right? Isn't the greenhouse in here? Where's the Rose Raid? Rose Raid's right here. Your Aristarchos Rose Raid. We should dance again sometime. Okay, never mind. So my assumption would then be... It's not the Volby, right? Yeah, okay. So... Uh... Okay. Tell me a secret. Sometimes when I am alone, it's one of the people confirmed. Okay, that's what I thought. My ditto and I watch movies together. Then when we are done, they transform it into the main character and I ask them silly questions. Okay, what about... Huh? Back in Sinnoh, I've got a wife, Venera. She's beautiful. She, she's she got beautiful white hair. She aged like fine wine, unlike me. I call her most days when time allows. Sometimes I can talk to my son. He's called Vega. He's busy most days, though. He's just he's just gotten married. I could call her. Though, you know, when it's a phone call going from down here to Sinnoh, time is money. Congratulations. Think about Ditto's entire journey through the facility. Bro, you act. I feel like it's Tajiri or Go Lightly. I came in in Joltic form. Since no one else was looking there, I headed to your office. <clears throat> Did I not yell that it was going to the lounge yet loudly enough? I don't know. By the time I'd gone in there with him, I couldn't hear. Would you all calm down? Oh, this is just making it more... Bro, why is this so difficult for me? I heard the door was blocked by snow. I went to go see if I could fix the issue. Unfortunately, as you know, that didn't work. I assumed the ditto ran out of the lounge, went outside, then blocked the entrance. What? It's a smart ditto if it knew how to do... What? What am I missing? Why is... Can I give a hint? No. <laughs> so after the ditto tur yes, the entrance was blocked, it seems. It does seem to be that the entrance was blocked. And we already got a hint, it's one of the humans. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> when Garcia returned, I still waited in the lounge trying to find the real Pikachu. What? Yeah, we got a hint, it's one it of the It was the Del Caddy, oh, huh? Nah, that's too much of a hint. Do you try in Dr. Tajiri's dorm? They may have gone looking for him. That would make sense. An Arcanine Bark still here, waiting at the entrance. I guess that if anything or anyone funny ran past, I'd see them. You're overthinking things? Ecat, do you know who I am? I was about to say. I saw Aristarchov going to investigate, Scarlet going to the locker room, go lightly, so he was going to check on his Del Caddy. Alright, well if I'm overthinking things. See, you're all gonna yell at me when I get this wrong. So I'm gonna try and think really simple. No. If I So I don't know, I'd be overthinking this too. I'm someone who plays Ace Attorney and Dongon Rompo, so I'd definitely be overthinking it.
I'm going to reiterate my entire journey statement. Yeah, so the ditto went from the entrance to the lounge. Then went to Clementine's dorm, where we saw Aristokov. Bro, dude, I can't remember things. This is my issue. You can at least say it did not directly go to Clementine's dorm. Yeah, I feel like it went somewhere. You know, Alex, that's too much of a hint. No, I'm kidding. Bro. Ah! <laughs> My memory is failing me. Let me know if you want... You want me to remind... Can I get a hint about how you should approach the...